Jenny, the principal, is amazing. I don't think I've met anyone like Jenny. Never. A beautiful soul, that one. Sounds like an angel. Yeah, not many of them in this world. <laughs> she saved our little family. I was in London um, and basically had, had received a call um, that mum was in ICU on life support. I got to say that my kids were at school, that's as far as I got before I went into cardiac arrest. We didn't have any other families. It was sort of a case of the kids were at school needing someone to take them straight away. All I wanted to do was just be with my family. Just get home. The only certainty in this distressingly uncertain of situations... A nurse told me that the kids were with the principal. I was like, what? Amber and brother Gabriel were safe in the warm home and embrace of school head Jenny Clark as mum Jamie lay seriously ill in hospital with a large tumour on her adrenal gland and big sis Tanika battled the gauntlet of COVID travel and quarantine returning from Britain. I don't think even she understands how significant this is to us and there's nothing we can do to thank her enough. Well, she's in for a surprise. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Jenny, or rather Mrs Clark, is taking an assembly in here. We're going to barge in, which is rather rude, but of course it's for the right reasons. Hello, everyone. <laughs> How are you guys? Is Mrs Clark a nice, kind principal? I hear that she has been particularly kind to two students here when their mum was really, really sick. We've got a segment called ASB Good as Gold and because of what Mrs Clark did for Gabriel and Amber, we're delighted to tell you guys that Mrs Clark is this week's ASB Good as Gold recipient. <laughs> She'll be receiving $5,000 for her and another $5,000 for the school. Awesome. <laughs> it's extraordinary. It was actually our family's pleasure to help uh, Gabriel and Ember. And um, my thinking is that if my, my whanau were, were left in a tight spot, that I would want other people to help them. Schools are caring places and um, you know, my just response was, you know, I'll, I'll take them home with me. How did they fit in at home? Well, I think to start with, they were a bit shocked. Gabriel couldn't believe there was a house without an Xbox. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you know, by the end of it, they fitted in beautifully. I'd do it again, at, you know, in a heartbeat. You love all your students, I'm sure, but a special place in your heart. Yes, I haven't got 165 beds, so they mustn't. <laughs> I don't think I've done anything extraordinary other than um, walk the values that I think our school um, stands by to be kind and responsible. I'm sure we'll have a lifetime friendship as a result of this little blip in your lives. A heartfelt sentiment and one we think worthy of something a little extra. The ASB would love to give you and your mum $5,000 as well. Oh, stop it. <laughs> That's amazing. Thank, thank you guys so much. That's incredible. I just can't. I did not expect that. <laughs> Great. Now it's put on me. <laughs> it's a nice way to to show the community's got a heart. It's what we all want. If you know a deserving New Zealander, nominate them at asbgoodasgold.co.nz.